Mesdames et messieurs, ladies and gentlemen, many people say that Saad is a great writer, a genius. But have you ever read his horrible novels? It is so disgusting! Saad is wrong. Saad is sick. Saad is a monster! He is the origin of Nazism and the godfather of all serial killers. This guy should be banned forever. His books should be burnt! <clears throat> Please, um, don't think that I am joking. I do believe that Sad was sick. And if I agreed to read in front of you some pages of this evil writer filled with horrible sins and dreadful maxims, my sole purpose is your edification. I want you to be aware of the dangers of this sick philosophy. <clears throat> Let me read some pages of his first novel, Justine. And soon you will say to, Sad is wrong, Sad is sick, Sad is a monster. Justine by Marquis de Sade. Page one. Most people say that virtue will gain over vice. The good will be rewarded and evil punished. I want to travel with you a different way. Vice will be triumphant and virtue Victim. Oh, beautiful artist, oh, beautiful is pain. I want to exhibit a woman wandering from one misery to the next, the toy of villainy, the target of debauch, exposed to the most barbaric caprices. <laughs> oh, beautiful artist, oh, beautiful is pain. The robber wets the poor little girl. The banker wets the poor little girl. The slave himself wets the poor little girl. And even the king reads the poor little girl. The enemies read the poor little girl. And the friends read the poor little girl. The lover read the poor little girl. And the father read the poor little girl. Oh, beautiful love Justine was the beautiful daughter of a rich banker. She was full of tenderness, candor, decency, and timidity. She was a charming creature with naive grace and delicate traits are beyond our power to describe. But... Her father was precipitated in bankruptcy and died of grief. One month after, his wife followed him into the grave. And Justin, only 12 years old, 
became orphan and poor. Justin, listen to me. If being orphan and poor, you meet with nothing but pain. Why the wicked are happy? Abandon yourself to vice. Virtue looks so beautiful, but it is the worst attitude when it is fun to feeble, to contend with vice. Evil is the best way to good. Evil is the best way. Evil is the best way to good. Evil is the best way. In a fully corrupted age, the safest way is to join with the wicked who flourish than with the good ones who die. From every evil, some good is born, so you can give yourself over to evil. Evil is the best way to good. Evil is the best way. Evil is the best way to good. Evil is the best way. Justine, homeless and starving, was hugged as a maid by a man who had become rich by lending money. One day, the greedy master Ask Justine to steal the jewels of a rich neighbor. Justine, full of honesty and morale, refused to steal. And the nasty master, mad at Justine, pretended she had robbed him, and she was arrested by the police. Sent in jail, sent in jail, drain, 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 An honest worker was poor, a greedy master was rich. The master sleeps in a bed, the worker sleeps in jail. Poverty is a vice, poverty is a crime, poverty is a crime, poverty is a vice. The trial of a poor girl who has no money, no friends, is conducted with dispatch in the kingdom of money. Poverty is a vice. Poverty is a crime. Poverty is a crime. Poverty is a vice. It's a land where virtue is not friend with misery. It's a land where poverty is enough to be guilty. Poverty is a vice. Poverty is a crime. Poverty is a crime. Poverty is a vice. Drink, 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 drink. Justin, in jail, met an old prostitute, a woman as celebrated for her beauty than for the number of her crimes. The old prostitute told Justine, You are free, little girl. You can choose the kind of life you wish. But I advise you, we know the practice of virtue which is the curtain to disaster. Oh, madame, replied Justine, there are religious principles within me. 
If providence one day difficult my life, it is in order to compensate me in paradise. Wow! Forget God's justice! His punishments and rewards! Those lies lead us nowhere but to death from starvation! Justine, let's escape from this jail together! Justine, and in two years, I will have led you to a fortune. <laughs> oh, Madame, replied Justine, I accept to escape with you from this jail, but I will prefer a thousand deaths than the anguish to participate in crime. Look at this poor little girl! The barbaric providence has condemned us to crawl in the dust of humiliation as the snake in mud. We are beheld with disdain only because we are poor. We are tyrannized because we are weak. Virtue is slavery. Crime is freedom. Whoa! The upper class dominating us has all the blessings of fortune and we reserve for ourselves nothing but pain and beating. Whoa! Virtue is slavery. Crime is freedom. Whoa! Crime is the best way to establish justice. Whoa! Let's rob. Whoa! Let's rape! Oh, let's kill! Oh, when evil becomes necessary, this evil is good! Oh, virtue is slavery! Crime is freedom! Crime is freedom! Crime is freedom! Prostitute have escaped from jail and are hiding in the forest with four male criminals. One night, Justine succeeds to escape from her tormentors and runs off in the woods. Senses. Justin is at the foot of a tree away from any road. 
She is naked, and her soul is in blood again. Injured, bleeding, dishonored, crying, her body lacerated. Justin wishes to put an end to her death. Oh. 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 The girl has more than one feather to deal. Nearby the camp, there is an obscure cave. Into whose solitude love returns. This cave is called the asshole. If pregnancy frightens the girl, so Domi is the safest way. Ah, however hard will be the attack. The asshole won't betray the girl. So Domi is heaven, asshole is paradise. So Domi is heaven, asshole is paradise. Domi is heaven, our soul is paradise. So Domi is heaven, our soul is paradise. And you will stay a virgin forever. Because as soon as the bee stops to suck the pollen, the rose closes shut. Again, and you will be a virgin forever. So Domi is heaven, heaven is paradise. So Domi is heaven, a soul is paradise. So Domi is heaven, a soul is paradise. So Domi is heaven, a soul is paradise. was badly bitten by the dog of the homosexuals. But she was lucky. A good doctor took care of her. Unfortunately, the good doctor And of course, how do you guess this band of vicious guys? Of course, the pedophile is strongly attracted to the 12 years old, beautiful, innocent Justine. One night, the good doctor. Greatly aroused enter the room of Justine oh, slams the door oh, sizes her hand oh, drags her into the basement oh, and ties her to a wing 
seated upon a pillar, standing in the middle of the punishment room. Ah, ah, please, good doctor, have pity upon me. Ah, ah, piercing screams in the punishment room. The good doctor has no pity. And buttons her dress, and soon she's naked again. The good doctor, holding a whip, approaches his victim and kisses her beautiful skin. You are so beautiful, and here he whips, 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 whips the face, whips the belly, whips the breast. Wins the sex! Uh, uh, the lashes of the whip are brought upon every inch of the body of the poor little girl. The tender pink, uh, the tender pink of the skin became a red sea. Just in cries, piercing screams, piercing. But the good doctor is a monster that can take pleasure in tears and pleasure, oh, that can take pleasure in tears and sufferings, oh, and is made all the more furious by the tears, oh, and he weeps again and weeps and weeps and weeps. The pain of the skin is immense, and the joy of the doctor is immense, piercing squeal in the punishment wounds. And finally, he wish, ah, he wish, ah, the whips manages ah, to open ah, the set of twisting. You know what, Justin? You know I love you. Stop the crying. You know, I am a doctor, you know. I have studied. I know what I know. I know what I say. And I say what I know. And you know what? We are saved that the wasting of the sperm in an asshole is a sin. <laughs> the sperm is supposed to be put in us for the sole purpose of reproduction. If you waste your sperm, you will go to hell! Oh, no, 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 no. But nature itself! Permit the loss of semen one million times a day. Nocturnal pollutions, but not to yourself. Permit the loss of semen one million times a day. Masturbation. So the loss of sperm in an asshole is not a crime. Sodomy and homosexuality are not crimes because nature is dead. Permit the loss of semen one million times a day. I fuck you up the ass one million times a day. Nature itself is not a sin. It's not a sin. Oh, 
und sie zu kurz in the monastery of the holy monks de The monastery is occupied by four solitary monks of peerless devotion whose continence and sobriety Without example. And Justine is eager to implore aid at their feet. <clears throat> Unfortunately, the holy monks are scattered away. Back to the story. I want to help you to understand. Ding dong. The superior of the monastery, the most saintly of men, received her with perfect good grace, doing all offers as he had, what of she can possibly stand in need. Then the superior leads Justin towards the obscure back of the church. You must save your soul, my child. Oh yes, my father, I am a sinner. It's time for confession, Justine. On your knees. Oh, I beg your pardon, my father. Punish me. Yes, you are a sinner, Justine. An adventurous old bitch. I'm going to punish you. Yes, father. I deserve to be punished. You are a sinner. I'm going to slap your nipples with my paws. Oh, father, have pity for my delicate nipples. No, I have no pity for nipples. I have no pity for sinners. I am going to slap with my paws your lubricious perverted nipples. Oh! You're going to kill me, father! No matter, my dear son, if you die, life is so painful and death is a great pain. So my love is good, so just in I'm going to slap you with my cross until you die! Ding dong! Ding dong! Ding dong! Ding dong! <laughs> and he strikes out so savagely the poor little nipples. That blood appears on the nipples. <laughs> The sick monk 
drink the blood of the nipples of Justine. Ding dong. You have confessed your sins and been punished, my child. Now it's time for communion. Ding dong. Ding dong. And the monk forces Justine to kneel on his seat on the mouth of Justine, his asshole pressed into the lips of Justine, and <laughs> ding dong, <laughs> he shits in the mouth of the poor little girl, <laughs> dong dong, and Justine is forced to eat the shit of the moon. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. And the moon comes. Oh! His dick gushes out madly. His dick gushes on the ground. His dick gushes on the ground. His dick gushes on the I'm not a monster, but indeed I am a savage beast. You will be punished by God. Ah! There is no God. Ah! Ding dong. Ah! Christianity is the worst of all religion. Ah! The Christ. Ah! Pretending to be the son of God. Who oh, he, he but an Ah! Ding dong. Ah! He created a sect. For slaves, imbeciles, and women! Ah, ah. And what is this God? Transforming bread, eaten by fanatics, lurk into the bottom of their guts, and finally change in Because the stronger is always a better reason, Justine. Why should I be what by criminals? Because the stronger is always a better reason, Justine. And why should I be tortured by criminals? Because the stronger is always a better reason, Justine. And why should I be right by criminals? Because the stronger is always the better with all this thing. Ah, 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 stop, ah, stop to cry, that's it. Hey, hey, oh, stop to cry, ah. The Greeks enjoy the right to kill kids, okay? Ah, the Romans permitted to kill kids, okay? Even in the Bible, God himself orders I want to kill kids, okay? And I'll shut up! Shut up, Justin. Stop to complain. I've got a lecture to do. Uh, I am in National Museum. Shut up. Shut up, please. Let me have my lecture. Uh. 
excuse me, for the little incident. You know that kids are a little rebellious sometimes. So, madame and messieurs, ladies and gentlemen, you have heard those horrible stories by sad on those dreadful maxims. And now you know why sad is the origin of Nazis and the godfather of all serial killers. Now you know why sad is so sick. Sad is wrong. Sad is a monster. And to, to have a happy end, Justine, please come here, stand up. This is the happy end, Justine. Don't be shy. It's okay, baby. You will take a bath. It's okay. To have a happy end, let's pray with this unfortunate Justine, poor little orphan. Let's implore the help of God together, Justine. Help us, God, in such a cruel world. Huh? Let's kneel together, Justine, and pray. Holy Majesty, my protector and my guide, I implore your help. I'm innocent and weak. I was mistreated. I was betrayed. My eyes, full of tears, turned toward the sky. My earth flies to the feet of God who stays in the pure glittering sky. I cast myself down, kneeling before the crucified Christ. Hope of the poor, My protector and my guide, I implore your help. I have wished to do well in imitation of Jesus, and I am still punished. I respect. complain but please powerful God take me into your paradise far away from this evil man what did I 